Hi guys, today in this video we are going to look at the Lewis structure for methanoic acid. It has a chemical formula of HCOOH and to find out its Lewis structure, we are first going to find out the total number of valence electrons for this molecule. So when you calculate the valence electrons for all these atoms, you will get a sum total of 18 valence electrons for this molecule. And now that we know the total number of valence electrons, we are going to place all the atoms and see the arrangement of atoms in this molecule. So carbon atom will take the central position because it is less electronegative than all the atoms present over here. The hydrogen atom will go on the outside. The OH group will be placed here and one oxygen atom will be placed on the upper side of the carbon atom. So this is the arrangement of atoms in the lowest structure. Now that we have done the arrangement of the atoms, we are going to move forward by placing a pair of electrons between two atoms to show the bonds. So a pair of electron for here, here, here and here. We have used up 8 valence electrons out of 18 and now we are left with 10 more valence electrons. So we will place these valence electrons around the atoms that are on the outside. We will try to complete the octets for the atoms that are located on the outside and then we will move to central atom. So here you can see that oxygen has uh, two valence electrons and it needs six more to complete its octet. So we are going to place the six valence electrons here. Similarly, we are going to come back here for this oxygen atom and as you can see it has 2 plus 2 it has 4 electrons and it only needs 4 more electrons to complete it so we are going to place 4 electrons over here and hence we have used up all 18 valence electrons now look at the atoms and try to find out what which atoms have the complete octet structure so here hydrogen atoms have 2 valence electrons in its outer shell which means it has a complete octet it has attained a stable structure when you look at the oxygen atoms both of these oxygen atoms have 8 valence electrons which means the, both these atoms have complete octets but when you come to carbon atom it only has six valence electrons here which means it is short on um, two more electrons to complete its octet and hence what we will do is we will move a pair of electrons from this oxygen atom to here and we will see if the octets are complete for both these atoms so oxygen still has eight valence electrons but by moving these electrons over here even carbon has eight electrons so by moving these electrons we are also making one bond here which means there will be a double bond between carbon and oxygen atom over here so this is so in this structure all the atoms have complete octets as you can see and there will be a double bond between a carbon and oxygen atom and to give you an idea, COOH is a carboxylic acid functional formula. You can come up, you will come across this uh, functional group a lot when you are doing the chemical reactions or when you're going through other topics. So you can remember this functional group and in this functional group, carbon has a double bond with oxygen atom and single bond with uh, OH group. So you can remember it that way. And this is the Lewis structure for methanoic acid. For more such videos on Lewis structure, polarity, molecular geometry, hybridization and polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And thank you for watching.